Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha has loaded the move to phase out the Bachelor of Education degree program that currently qualifies teachers to teach in secondary schools. In order for us now to train our teachers who are going to teach in the high school, who are going to teach CBC in the high school, in addition to the ones that are already there who are just getting the upgrading, the newer ones can be taught differently. That's how it is. Change is always there. According to Magoha, the proposal by the Teacher Service Commission requiring teachers to undertake a Bachelor of Science followed by a one-year postgraduate diploma in education will equip teachers with the right skills in teaching the new CBC curriculum in secondary schools. Going forward, there is need for us and we are going to have the first uh, group of uh, diploma teachers trained from June, next year, from June this year. It has delayed because of COVID. And their focus will be the competency-based curriculum. When you get to the university level, we have already prepared our universities to start the intake, and perhaps this would be the right time for thinkers and scholars like myself to think and decide whether it is the time to do things differently. In sweeping reforms aimed at ensuring the seamless rollout of the competency-based curriculum, the TSC wants all universities to cease offering the bachelor's course by September this year. They are proposing that students who wish to pursue a career in teaching undertake regular degree courses in arts or science, followed by a one-year postgraduate diploma in education. The government has been upgrading the teachers' training, but the teachers who, who, whom we have are already well trained they just to tweak them to be able to teach a CBC in primary school. And our the Bachelor of Education program has been the requirement course for Kenya secondary school teachers since its introduction in 1972. Jujina Magundu, K24 Weekend Edition.